this short video will show you how to enable the I2C communication in your Raspberry Pi. So the very first thing that we need to do is to connect with our Raspberry Pi. I'm using Putty. So I'm just going to click my Raspberry Pi. So this is the IP address. And then I'm going to log in with my credentials. Once I'm, I log in, then I just run the sudo raspberry config tool or the Raspberry Pi software configuration tool. And inside the Raspberry Pi configuration tool, we just select the interface option, click enter, and then go to the I2C. And then for the prompt, if, you're, if we would like to enable the I2C, just click the yes. And then it will say that the my I2C interface is now enabled. So then the, the last thing is to finish. Once finished, then just execute sudo reboot so we can reboot our Raspberry Pi. Now that the Raspberry Pi is already rebooted, then we can check our Raspberry Pi if the I2C is already in configured by using this command ls mod then grab i2c and then it should show you the following kernel modules i have connected a bme 280 in my raspberry pi so there is another method to check for the i2c which is the i2c detect tool and then just click Y and then the name of the bus is 1 and as you can see there is a number here which is 76 which is the I2C address of my BMA 280 so which, this means that my Raspberry Pi is ready for I2C communication since I have already detected my I2C device which is the BMA 280 that's it happy exploring